Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. My name is Nur Hamizah binti Janawi. My metric number is A177295. I'm doing a video reaction for subject LMCE1062 Academic Interaction and the title of the video is Plastic Disaster and Ocean Pollution Documentary. In this video, there are six speakers and they are Annika Ballon from Alkalita Research, Nancy Schrotz from Hill the Bay, Christopher Nagel from Marine Mammal Care Center, Gilbert Castilian from Safrida Foundation, Richard Omaki, a local sufferer, and Kim Tsukati, a local volunteer. They are talking about the plastic effect to sea animals, how the plastic can be flowed on the sea, and how to prevent plastic pollution. Based on the video I watched, the speaker named Annika Bellen said that ocean pollution get bad impact to sea animals as they think plastic that floating in the ocean was food plastic and emitted their natural food sources. Annika Bellen and her team find huge amounts of red items in sea animals' gut when they die, which is plastic. Gilbert Castilian said that plastic is dangerous to sea turtles because they may think the floating plastic was jellyfish, the food they like to eat. Christopher Nagel said that sea lion will grab something to eat and swallow it without chewing. They will grab and swallow the plastic bottle that floating on the ocean with algae on it. The speakers have found that leaving plastic packaging on the beaches is one of the sources of ocean pollution. I agree with this statement because sometimes there are a group of irresponsible people that left their food plastic packaging on the beach after they have done their activities on beach. The other source of pollution is people's trash from 50 miles inland. I couldn't agree more with this statement because we not only see many trash on the beach but also on the roadside and sometimes people didn't throw their trash into the trash bin correctly. Annika Ballon said the ocean are too big and it would take 10 hundred years to be able to clean it up. So, the way to reduce this pollution is stop plastic entering the ocean be doing beach cleanup. I agree with this because we can't clear all the plastic pieces in the oceans, so we just clean up the beach to make sure there are only little trash that drain into the ocean. The other way to reduce ocean pollution that stand in this video are away with plastic water bottle which is try to get water that has non-plastic containers and banning of plastic products. Based on the statement, in my opinion, why not government just use biodegradable plastic and charge a high price for a plastic bag instead of banning it, so that people will find another initiative to bring their grocery and the use plastic bottle, it can be reusable to make a new landscape instead of throw it. From this documentary, I stand up that plastic gave bad impact to marine life and caused extinctions to them. And we, as humans that have common sense, why not us be a responsible people that always keep our place clean? I have an experience on beach and clean up activity. I've joined a program to clean up the beach and I just found a lot of plastic packaging and plastic straw along the beach. I hope everyone will be a responsible people because to keep our place clean is not just a cleaning job, but it's our job together. Lastly, please take care of our sea and marine life and also keep the ocean and beach clean because God loves to the cleanliness. That's all from me. Thank you for watching.